five children. All right, Shalom. First off, I would like to give our glory, honor, and infinite praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Rahach, Badas. Devil honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that teach and rule well and labor in 100% doctrine who, who, who I learned the truth from, Salaki. Okay, according to the Bible. Okay. Shout a warm to the hopeful elect pushing this truth and our righteousness and its sincerity around the four winds of the earth. Shout a warm to the few aqua, the few sisters come back being silent as the scriptures commanded them to do so. I'm the Akim Ha Amayan. And um, just another another hit, man, another lesson, another video doing his work, okay? Um, This video. I'm about to play. It says, uh, at least five kids killed after wind blow bouncy castle in the air. Okay. So, um, uh, yeah, man. There you have it, man. You know, the Lord is bad, man. The Lord is showing out, man. The Lord is showing out, man. Okay. And before I bring that out, let me get, uh, Isaiah chapter 45 and verse 7. It reads, I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, Yahweh Bashem Shah, do all these things. Okay? The Lord do these things, man. Okay? Uh, let me get a... Uh, the whole Amos 3. <clears throat> This video. Children have died after falling from an inflatable bouncy castle that was thrown into the air by a sudden gust of wind. The West Australian newspaper names Zane Gardam and Addison Stewart as two of the victims. The events that have occurred today are just shattering. They, they are just unthinkably heartbreaking. The kids, who were sixth grade students, were celebrating the last day of school with their families in Tasmania, Australia, when the wind gusts blew the bouncy castle 30 feet high. On a day when these children were meant to be celebrating their last day of primary school, instead we're all mourning their loss. Helicopters rushed injured children to the hospital and first responders performed CPR. Witnesses say it was a sunny day and the wind wasn't that strong. This is a tragic incident and I want to pass on my deepest sympathies to the families impacted. A horrific loss felt by the entire community. This is Inside Edition Digital. Okay. See, man, y'all by some out shots showing out, man. Okay, Amos chapter 3, verse 6. Shall a trumpet be blown in the city and the people not be afraid? Shall that be evil in the city and the Lord y'all by some out shots have not done it? Okay. Yeah, they were trying to celebrate the last day of school, but the Lord said otherwise, man. Job chapter 4, verse 7. Well, remember, I pray thee, whoever perished, being innocent, or where were the righteous cut off? We may look at, well, not, not me, myself, but, you know, people look at, oh, man, these just kids, man. Guess what, man? The Lord is not a respecter of persons, man. Human, mankind is, man. The Lord is not, man. The Lord is not a respecter of person. If the Lord wants you, he getting you, man. If the Lord wants you, he's getting at you, man. Deuteronomy, chapter 32 and verse 39. And it reads, See now that I, even I am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive, I wound and I heal, neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. Okay, see, the Lord is doing this, man. Okay, the Lord is doing this. Y'all don't want to give the Lord his credit. Looking for that account of Job. This is Job chapter nine, verse twelve. I'm gonna grab this and say, Behold, he taketh away who can hinder him, who will say unto him, What do is thou? Okay. Um, I was looking for he giveth and taketh away. 
I think that's the one. But, yeah, man, y'all about some out shots doing this, man. The Lord is doing this. The Lord is terrible, man. He is to be feared. Five children. It's going to get worse than that, man. The Jacob Trouble, it's going to be thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands. That's what the Lord is about, man. Getting his point across. Okay? So, I brought this out. Y'all was edified. Okay? I would like to close out this lesson by giving all glory, honor, and infinite praises to Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah Ba'ashem, Rechakodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone that teach them rule well and labor in 100% doctrine. Shalom to the hopeful elect pushing this truth in our righteousness and the sincerity around the four winds of the earth. Okay? Quam Yasha Allah, Abba Baal, Barak Kal Akim. The Lord is to be feared, man. Shalom.